Uh, and one of the things where uh, the issue may be uh, in question is the issue of transparency and control. Uh, because it's a more abstracted layer of knowing where things are and knowing how they're managed. Um, but it's an abstraction layer. It, one of the things about cloud is the questions that we're asking today about the cloud are not new questions. They're the traditional questions we've asked for quite a while. Where's my information? Who controls it? Who has access? How's it being used? Who's it being shared with? And who's looking out for my interests? Those are standard questions that we have in the environment. The question with the cloud is, it makes them a little more immediate sometimes because there's less of a one-to-one -one relationship because a cloud provider may be less distinct than a d definite service provider. I bought a book from this bookstore online make, may make someone feel more comfortable. Yet that bookstore online may have a back end that looks very much like a cloud. So you may already be having the same questions in your current interactions. So again, what I'm trying to point out is cloud in many ways is a matter of degree when we look at policy issues, not necessarily a complete phase shift. I uh, wanted to look at some of the operational issues, so performance and availability clearly. Uh, how is the cloud supported? How is it interoperable? What's the oversight? What's the audit control that you're looking for? And a, and a concern from perhaps more business than consumers is some of the idea of uh, how, how do you end the relationship? How do you, how do you avoid lock-in? Uh, making sure that um, you can have perhaps open standards in order to facilitate that, making sure there's portability. But one of the things I want to stress, and this is especially in the business case, the lock-in is likely to be more a case of the way in which you use the service, because in many cases this service may become a strategic element of your business. And anything that becomes a strategic element of your business becomes much harder to intertwine. It's not a question of the software doesn't prevent you from doing it, it's a question of it becomes part of the DNA of your company, and that's a lot harder to disentangle.